Neetika and today I'll be making Gongura chutney. It's also called Mesta leaf chutney in English, Pundi chutney in Kannada and Pulichakire chutney in Tamil. So first I'll tell you the benefits of Gongura. Gongura looks something like this and it, it, is, uh, it contains a lot of vitamin C and iron and is mostly found abundantly in summer. So we'll get started now. The ingredients are garlic, gongura, salt, chilies, groundnuts and onion. Should be cut up to this size. So first I'm going to boil the gongura. With, uh, no, uh, we are going to use uh, boiling even with the chilies. So first pour the water. the chilies and then add the mister leaves so now it's currently boiling you have to wait till the leaves turn brown So it's boiled. I've boiled it for three minutes. Now I'm going to switch it off and let it cool. It's done smoke. So now it has cooled down. I'm going to pour this inside this. If you want this to with the water, if you want this to be more liquid, you can add two glasses of water instead of one. So after this, I'm going to add groundnuts. The salt, garlic, and onion. Sorry, onion is not supposed to be added now. Uh, we're going to be mixing it. yet so we're going to do it again let's see again it's almost done we just have to do it and one last time It's ready now. It should look some, somewhat like this. And now we are going to serve. So I put it into the bowl. And it does not have to be very, it doesn't have to be like a paste. It has to be something like this. So we are going to add the onion. We can add how much ever onion we want. The Mesta chutney is made in different ways in different parts of India, but in uh, this type of chutney is made in Rail Seema, a place in Andhra Pradesh. So, well, we are done now. I'm going to taste it. You can make this as a side for dosa, chutney, and all. This is for the Idlis too. Mm. You can eat this with the rice like a side. So now I'm going to try it. It's really nice. You can eat it with ragi muda also. I hope you liked it. Bye.